This is chapter 16, example 2. Once again, we're, we're tasked with using a decoder to, to solve this uh, given problem. So this circuit says I have four inputs and two outputs, so that's worth drawing right there. We've got to give a good name for these inputs. It will say E, L, T, 8, even and less than 8, and odd G, T, 10. Good enough names. So this is essentially, once again, a, a table. And so let's crank this table out. So there's my table. I arbitrarily put a column for decimal in there that's going to help us do this problem. This first circuit here indicates when its input values are even and less than 8. And I will list this as MSB and LSB just to be sure. This part is less than 8. And what I have to do is mark when it's even. There's a 2. We're going to consider 0 to be even. 2, 4, 6. And I'm done with that. Anything that's not a 1 is a 0. The other output is when it's odd and greater than 10. This is what I'm looking at. This is These are the values that are greater than 10. So this one's 11, greater than 10, 13, and 15. Everything else is a 0. So once again, this is kind of brute force design, but uh, it worked once again, and we, maybe you could have a computer generate these if the table was too big. This arbitrarily had four inputs and two outputs, just what the problem required. I can have as many inputs and as many outputs as I want according to whatever the problem needs.